disbelief and questions. That's the response from friends and family after authorities say Sandra Bland killed herself in a Texas jail cell days after she was arrested following a traffic stop. She had a thirst for life. She was planning for the future and uh, she came here to start part of that future. So to say that she killed herself is totally absurd. The 28 year old had just landed a job at her alma mater in Texas. She was driving from her home in Chicago to the university to fill out paperwork for her new position. She's a good person. Always been a good person. Always encouraged everybody. Bland was pulled over on July 10th for failing to signal a lane change. Authorities say she became uncooperative and arrested her for assaulting a public servant. Three days later, Bland was found dead in her jail cell. If there was something nefarious or if there was some foul play involved, we'll get to the bottom of that. Authorities say she hanged herself, but some who knew her are skeptical. Protesters demanded answers at the Waller County Courthouse Friday. She was an activist. They want us to believe that our beautiful, talented, gifted young sister hung herself with a garbage bag. Bland was active in her community. She had a following on social media and was known for speaking out about racial injustice and police brutality. Video surfaced from March showing Bland saying she was depressed. Everybody has ups and downs, but that's why we have God. That's why we talk about God. That's why in, the, in that entire video, she did speak on depression, but she also spoke of how to, how to help with that, how to counter depression through your faith. Officials say the state trooper who stopped Bland violated traffic stop procedures and is now on administrative leave while the FBI investigates Bland's death. Krista Fourier, Associated Press.